This documentary has been kindly sponsored by Bubble. We embarked on a new adventure to France, where we stumbled upon a 16th century castle atop a distant countryside hill. Much to our surprise, we found ourselves inside a fully preserved castle with all the former owner's belongings still in place. Each room remained meticulously furnished just as the owner left them behind nearly two decades ago. However, the most astonishing discovery was a museum room filled with African artifacts, ranging from spares to bows. To our amazement, we even stumbled upon a gun within the confines of the castle. After doing some research, we discovered that this place belonged to Mr. Morin, a French aristocrat and descendant of the family that built the castle. Inheriting significant wealth, Morin had ample free time, which he spent traveling the world with a particular focus on Africa. After extensive travels throughout Africa, he met a woman, married her, and together they returned to France to reside in the castle. Over the years, they were blessed with four children. They lived here for quite a while, but Morin and his wife had a considerable age difference. Morin passed away in the year 2000, and shortly after, his wife chose to leave the castle. Since then, the place had become desolate and abandoned, with all their precious blinds still left inside. Let us take you on yet another thrilling adventure into one of France's many forgotten castles. I'm excited to announce that this week's video has been sponsored by Bubble. You probably know I travel worldwide and it's crucial for me to speak the local language, to be able to connect to the people and also retrieve information about the places we're filming. And that's where Bubble comes in. Bubble allows me to learn a new language with ease and efficiency. I've been using Bubble for quite some time now and I'm generally impressed by its results. It has allowed me to learn fluent German and conversational French. I find it nice that I can use Bubble anywhere. I'm literally sitting in the middle of nowhere right now and I'm still able to practice my French. Cette robe est trop courte. Voilà. Cette I would like to buy a stylish suit. Je, achete, je voudrais acheter une costume élégant. It's so nice how it's all set up and yeah. Bubble is one of the top language learning apps in the world and it teaches real world conversations and it prepares you to talk about travel, business, relationships and more. Bubble has a few different subscriptions to choose from, including a lifetime subscription. If you're watching this video on television, make sure to scan the QR code over here or go in the description and click the link over there. Learning a new language will help you follow along on our future explorations because we encounter a lot of different languages by going throughout these places. It's a very cool thing to do and to be able to connect to us and the places we film even more. And supporting our sponsors also supports us, so it's a great way. So once again, thank you so much to Bubble for sponsoring this video. And if you want to follow along on our explorations in the future, make sure to scan the QR code, follow the link on the screen, or go on the link in the description. Thank you very much, and let's go on with an epic exploration right now. Welcome back everybody to the Bros of DK. 
I am Leslie, and like usual behind the camera, Sir Danny. Hello, hello everyone. And I'm saying that today because we're filming an abandoned chateau in France, a beautiful castle that used to be of a family that lived here and left everything behind. Danny, this is your one of your first castles in France. What do you think about this one? This castle is unique. It's beautiful. I'm so excited to explore it. And you guys are definitely gonna love this one, so stick around until the end of the video. You're not gonna believe your eyes. We start off this video here in the humble hallway that will lead into the castle. And as you can see, everything from these people is still left behind here. It's absolutely incredible. Even the DVDs. VHS. VHS, excuse me, so long ago yeah. <laughs> that they recorded are still there. Wonderful painting behind it. What do you see over there? Oh my, no way. <laughs> I didn't even see that. It's a complete photo album. Oh, we knocked something down. We'll clean it up in a second. And as you can see from the pictures here, this is Moran, the man of the family. And I think this might have been his daughter or his wife. Wow, that's absolutely. Is this inside of the castle or in Africa where they were? Uh, not here. No. Wow. There's even more photo albums yeah. left over here. Jeez, everything, like we told you before, everything from these people is still left in this castle. Those are photo albums, yeah. Wow, look at that. Isn't that incredible? Military service, as you can see. Wow, school picture, I think. Oh, Danny, that's in the dining room. Yep. So Moran, uh, Mohen went a lot to Africa and there he met his wife and I brought his wife back here to France and they married and got a lot of children, four children who also lived in this place. Wow, it's crazy that all their photo albums are all still left behind over here. And then the front door, which hasn't been opened in forever. The spider webs are so thick. There's also oh, a big spider in there. Big spider in there, yeah. Yep. Don't want to mess with that one. <laughs> no. And even their jackets are still hanging there. There's a... What are you seeing? Um, turtle <gasps> shell. Two. Oh. Two of them. Oh, wow. That's incredible to find. <laughs> even their shoes behind there. Danny, have you seen the motorcycle that's standing here in the middle of the hallway? I think that must have been of that young boy. A very small motorcycle. And it, I think it was also very cool to ride around here in this French landscape through the mountains and through the bushes. Even still some plants left behind. You can see they went to Africa multiple times and probably even hunted animals. I'm not sure what kind of animal this is. Looks like a cheetah, maybe? Uh, I don't know. I think definitely it's not huntable nowadays anymore. No. Oh, so sad to see. Wow. Okay, and here, got the hall tree, and this leads us into the first room of this place. Embrace yourselves. This one is gonna be incredible from the first moment. <laughs> wow. A dining room inside the castle. You can definitely see the shape of it. It resembles like the arch style shape, which we see coming back a lot in French castles. The table where they used to have dinner. These wonderful chairs, Danny. Upholstery chairs. They're beautiful. Yeah. The carvings or leather work, it's amazing. Absolutely immaculate. And even the candle holders on the table itself. And as you can see, there are six chairs around the table. And Maureen and his wife, and they had four children. So it definitely makes sense. And this was the picture that we just saw from the boy. The boy was sitting right over here at the chair, at the table. <laughs> Look, the lantern is made into a spinning wheel. That's so cool. One thing you might not have noticed in this castle is actually, oh, in this room I mean, is actually that every single wall has been beautifully painted. Very unique. 
and the woodwork underneath there is also quite special. Just take a look at those walls. Take it in. Absolutely wonderful. I love it. It gives so much feeling to this, yeah. to this room. It can, makes it come alive. I like the colors as well. It's, it's unique. It's, it's very African colors. Yeah, very exactly. Brown. I think he definitely took inspiration for designing the castle. You can already see like for the cups and everything, their African style. I don't know exactly what African antiques look like. Wow. Pont Neva. Beautiful plate made in France. Of course, still having religious depictions everywhere throughout this place. I'm not gonna do it, but this is a small gong. You know what a gong is? Yeah. <laughs> and then the fireplace over here. The beautiful mirror above there. Wow. Yeah, the fireplace has a cover, so yeah. they clearly didn't use it. No. Oh no, they even have storage behind here. Jeez. Look at this picture. This is his family. These are the boys and, and the girls. <laughs> two girls and two boys. I think that's the child that we saw sitting at the table. You see, some are like very dark and some are a little bit whiter. So that's normal because he had a, a dark wife and he was white. <laughs> Jesus. Have you seen it? Yeah. A massive boar head. And that's a typically French animal that uh, he probably shot in the woods around this castle. And it's made. so crazy. <laughs> yeah. Like the fur, it's so big. It's definitely a real one. Yeah, oh yeah. Oh my God. Yeah, I don't want to encounter one of these in the woods of France no. because if they attack you, they can even kill you. It's yeah. it's crazy. Let me show you this one more time. Oh wow, this one I didn't even see it. This wall. It looks completely hand painted. Yeah, it is. It's a wall. Danny, look at this. We have a record player. We have a record player inside of this house. It's a very simple one, but I absolutely love simple? it. Simple. Yeah. He has a radio. He has everything. It's it's actually a really good one. I, I might say modern one, more modern. Oh, okay, not yeah. simple modern, yeah. Wow, this cabinet is amazing. I want you to first look at the middle piece here, the middle door, the dragons, <laughs> and the woman next to it. Absolutely beautiful. And let's also see if it has something inside of it. I'm pretty sure it has. It hasn't been opened in forever. Oh, yeah. All the cups and plates are still in here. Oh, jeez, what a room already. I love this for the first room of this place. Yeah. I think this is some sort of an art piece here. Rally de Trois Vols. Okay, this is for a rally that he, that he did in 1992. Very cool. Then he gave an overlook of this room. Wow. It's <sighs> so beautiful. Yeah. This must say that this castle, I think, we don't know the exact age of this castle, but I think it's very old looking from the style of this room. Yeah. Or at least a couple of centuries. Oh. Tapestry on the wall here. Kind of, this, is, this comes a lot in France, we have seen it. It's kind of embroidered. Yeah, exactly. It's something. You see this a lot in French places. Yeah. Doesn't even know, it doesn't even have to be a castle. Yeah. All the keys of the castle are also still left here. That's incredible. And it's a piece of a statue also left there. Okay, over here, the castle is literally starting to fall apart. Yeah, can you see can it. see it up there. Yeah. And uh, everything. All, everything fell down, but also the picture of his son fell to the ground. That's crazy. So sad to see a castle like this in this state. There's even a mushroom growing here. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, this used to be that bathroom. We're not gonna go in there, it's even like flooded, but as you can see, everything is still left behind, but everything is also falling apart. <laughs> it's just leaked water inside. Yeah. But now, I welcome you all into the kitchen of this place. A typical catching ca castle kitchen from that time period. 
Look at the beauty of this one. Yeah. Oh, wow. I don't even know where to start, Danny. Yeah. This kitchen is so small and it has so many things. Yeah. Like, can I just point up and start it yeah. with the chandelier? Oh, absolutely. It's very unique, right? It's like yeah. a sort of piece of wood. I don't know for what. Maybe for a horse saddle or something. Yeah, I don't know. I have no clue though. I want to show up here. We got these tin copper pots. Very old pots all standing up there. It's where they used to cook food with. What's this device? I have no idea. Looks very complicated. <laughs> No, see, it's the fridge is still full. <laughs> <laughs> Toilet paper. Wow, wow, that one is massive. Can you imagine what they used to make inside of here? Soup or family dinner or something like that. Here the kitchen looks pretty simple. All the ingredients are all still left in here. You see, like there's something strange going on here. Why would they leave all the stuff after Morin left, uh, left to him? Yeah, he, Morin passed away, but his wife and his children, of course, didn't pass away. I don't know if they inherited this. He was the man with the money, of course, but it seems all very strange to us. Yeah. A copper chandelier or copper candle holder on the table here. And then show this enormous fireplace that we have over here. It also has been intensively used over the years. Oh yeah, for sure. There's so many artifacts on top of this. The scale, oil lamps, everything. Depicting French culture is up there. Wow. I love that, that sort of crest up there. And I think the boar hat used to be attached to that. Yeah, something was up there, yeah. Yeah, it looks that's, like something for a that's boar for hat. sure, yeah. Also show inside of there. Got still some wood left behind here. Hasn't been used in ages. <laughs> no, covered in spiderwebs. I love that they also have the seat there in the corner so they could sit inside the fireplace and enjoy its heat. Wow. One more thing I think we have to show here, Danny. Uh, let me see this here. I love this plate. The food on there. But there's a small room to the side, and that's actually part of the tower. But they use it as a pantry to store everything. As you can see, it has an oval shape, and it's part of the tower of the castle. It smells inside. Yeah, probably very moldy in yeah, here. Yeah, and the fridge is open. Oh, I don't want to look at that fridge then. Yeah. <laughs> okay, really let's smells. go out of here. Damn. That was already incredible, but this castle is going to get even better. And I definitely want to say like we are doing so much effort to find these places. Definitely hit that subscribe button down there. You're not going to be disappointed by watching this channel. No, no, nope. not at all. Because this room is going to promise. Yeah, I'm just going to go in. Can yeah, I? Yeah, absolutely, Danny. Go ahead. Show the people this incredible room. And I think this is like the main room of this place the sitting area, but also the most prominent room. You're already looking at it and I want you to point it out. Look yeah. at this chandelier. It's special because it's completely still intact, but it also has all the spider webs around it, which makes it so unique. Yeah. And the rubble from the ceiling has covered the spider webs, which oh. make it white. Such a beautiful mix of DK, I would yeah, say. Yeah, that's beautiful. Oh. That's why I love exploring. You see a building in a whole other state. And you can also discover all these stories about people that used to live here. True, very true. Yeah, yeah you had sort of a very simple uh, computer desk over here <laughs> where you conducted this work. Everything is still there. Jeez. Also a small doll behind the computer. But I love that you have this simple computer desk and then these tapestries and beautiful furnishings all around it. It's so incredible. Yeah, the room is so elegant and there's just this modern stuff in this corner. Oh, Danny. What did you find? It's a uh, broken picture of his son. <gasps> oh, that's yeah, so sad. The glass is completely broken. Lovely boy. Let me put it up here. 
I've always find it so sad when all these pictures are lying on the ground. It's like memories thrown around. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah. Here's literally a gun. That's that. That's this so crazy. building. Oh. And it looks so beautiful, Danny. Have a look at this one. It even has a crest in there. You think it might still function? Oh, it most, uh, I mean. It's a bit deteriorated here, but probably still functions. It's definitely, oh, I'm not going to look into the barrel, yeah, <laughs> but it's one of those guns that you would load a little bit of powder and then a small metal ball and then press yeah. it. That looks like one of those um, wow. guns of, of war. They would have a, a, a spike in the, in the front. Exactly, like 1800s yeah, war. Yeah, doesn't, doesn't look like a hunting uh, No, no, weapon. it's not a hunting rifle. No, not at all. Just so beautiful, and it's it's here. It's just yeah, just, just lying here. here, just casually. Probably worth a lot of money. Most things in here are so, worth so yeah. much money. Another picture of a woman. This might have been the mother of his wife. Uh, she looks already a little bit older. His wife was younger. Wow. Nativity scene or something like that. I think. No, just Jesus. A little shrine or a little chapel. And then an enormous mirror behind it. <laughs> I love that there are so many tapestries in this room. All little ones, all small yeah, ones. Yeah. And normally we always, always see like big ones in these castles, but this is a, also has this charm. I yeah. really like it. Yeah, it has, and I imagine them all in the wall. I've seen this one before. This is definitely a copy of one. Um, I've seen this depiction before. I love it though. Yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah, also show the ones behind there. Wow. They're so beautiful and so unique. It's covering the television. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's actually pretty nice to just cover, cover it with it. a tapestry. Yeah. yeah, I would do that as well. <laughs> okay, I hope it doesn't fall. Don't want to break anything in here. A wonderful chair in front of it. I love the upholstery. Yeah, it's beautiful though. And it's like a set. You have another one here. It's like, <laughs> then take different. a step back, like show this. There's like two incredibly beautiful chairs here and then this yeah. ugly piece right in the middle there. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> I, it looks like a reclining chair. Oh yeah. Oh, it is. Ah, ah it's, it's electric. electric. One. It's yeah. electric. <laughs> but this one is different. It has carvings oh, yeah. on top. I didn't even see the woodwork yet. The roses and everything. Very so beautiful. beautiful. <laughs> We're like in sync inside of this yeah. castle. We are always in sync. Look at that. Oh, that's a wonderful wall clock over here. Again, it's not common to see no. the insides. These get stolen a lot of times, but yeah, this castle is this very is, unknown. I think they get stolen because it's copper. Yeah. It's worth a lot. But money. like you saw from the gun, everything is still here. Yeah, I, I also want to point it out, there's a lot of plaster work already on the floor. And you can see that after 21 years of abandonment, more than two decades now, this building is starting to fall apart and it's so sad. I find it so sad that these castles get left like this. Yeah, like especially castles like this, like big important things just yeah. left to, to decay. It's sad. sad. Omega. Have you seen this brand before? I think so. I, I don't quite remember. I discovered it a couple of times in abandoned places, but it's not a very common sewing machine brand. You know what this looks like? This looks like the one of the machines that we already found. Uh, puff, 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 puff. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It looks almost the same. Even the design of the, the sewing machine is I'm, resembles it. Yeah, I'm not quite sure. Puff is, is, is German, but I don't know yeah. if, if this one is also German. Beautiful, beautiful machine though, yeah. Even the flowers and everything still standing in the corner. Of course, those are fake. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Just gonna say it honestly, but. <laughs> all the flowers are yeah. fake in here. Another tapestry depicting somewhere in Arabia, I think it looks like. Wow, a marketplace. And then I think this is the biggest one in the room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. 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 It's almost similar size to the other one. But a beautiful one as well. That's incredible. 
I love how they must have made it back in the time. It yeah. took forever. I wish to make I something. could see people making it. It's so detailed. We don't make it nowadays anymore. We don't. I mean, we do, but in smaller scale, not yeah, big scale. Yeah, it's true. Even all the rocks on the floor are very unique. Have you, you, have you seen I that already? I haven't pointed out, but they uh, found like a lot of them. Like it's not the same. They just put half of it, half of each everywhere. Yeah, and this this can depict a mosque or something. I think. I'm trying to point it out. Let me just go here. See, you have the towers of the mosque here and here. And then, oh, this this depicts Mecca with the with the, with the stone. Yeah, I don't yeah. know how to say it exactly. Yeah, this, the, the the box. The, yeah, the where they run around. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not Muslim, but I know that this is Mecca. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. yeah, really cool. Um, Danny, we forgot one very yeah. important thing. <laughs> Look at this wonderful sofa over here, with the divided seat rests, beautifully upholstered. Absolutely oh, love this piece. And it's very low. Yeah. Which, again, it's so weird. Oh. This doesn't feel like a French seat. It's quite nice. Yeah? Yeah. It's quite nice. <laughs> and then two seats next to it with a similar style. Oh. I love this room already. Yeah. No, of course I love this room. <laughs> More beautiful tapestries here on the wall. He definitely loved African stuff. Yeah, 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 absolutely. He was fascinated by it. You can see it from everything in this place. That this man had a fascination for Africa. This is the Battle of Bastille. Oh, really? Yeah, it's what it says up there, La Bastille. Okay. It looks like a very cool depiction. Yeah, this is definitely from the family previous to him. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure that they must have lived here for centuries. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Danny. What a beautiful room. This is just the start of this epic video, so... Oh yeah, what's upstairs? <laughs> You're, it's gonna what's blow your mind. Come? It's gonna blow your mind. Yep. Okay, let's go upstairs then. Come over here, Danny. Have a look when you go up the stairs. You down, see, down the stairs. Down the stairs, yeah. They have a aerial shot of the castle from the backside. Wow, it looks so much less overgrown than it's now. Yeah, it's <sighs> so beautiful. Yeah, I love that it has two towers. Yeah, it's truly a castle. Yeah, exactly. And it's also like the fence on top of a mountain, so it's sort of protected, I would say. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's oh. literally on top of a mountain, yeah. yeah. It's diff very difficult it to get here. <laughs> yeah, believe us, it was very difficult to go Then he slipped, I slipped, I hit yeah. my back. <laughs> I'm not even going to show my ass yeah. because it's... No. Yeah. <laughs> here we have a wonderful plant hanging and all the spider webs around it. True signs of DK. <laughs> and of course, even more embroideries, tapestries throughout yeah. this place. What did you expect? I especially love this because for a painting you have to have the talent but for this you have to have precision to yeah. know the shadows to know where yeah. the eye is going to be like the dog look it's I think this takes even as much talent as making a painting uh, yeah of or course. even more yeah I, I wouldn't say more because there are different arts but definitely you can already see some African art coming here African art yeah I see from this woman oh. over here. That's what I'm trying to say. This is, these are butterflies. These are pieces of butterflies. Are you joking me? No, I'm, I'm talking serious. Oh, wow. Those are the wings of butterflies. Yeah. That's incredible. <sighs> that and must have it, also taken forever. <laughs> yeah. It's a bit sad, but it's, it's beautiful. Oh my God, I, I love, love this, this one. <laughs> <laughs> wow, it's the dog looking at the woman carving something into the tree. That's beautiful. It's beautiful. And the colors on yeah, it. Yeah, the colors, it's so so alive. I would love to have that one. Yeah, same. It's so meticulously made. I truly love it. I'm sure one. that everybody's watching right now and saying, yeah, I also love that. Look at that. If you, even if you look from far away, it doesn't look embroidered. It yeah. just looks like a painting. It is. It's beautiful. It is. Wow. Watch out, there's a chair behind oh, you. Almost... It's a very typical French thing to have a chair going up in your hallway, especially in the manners. I okay. think like, I have to ask why. 
You come up the stairs, you roll, you sit down for a second, you chill, and then you go further up the stairs. Really? I think it's that way, yeah. <laughs> it's so unnecessary. Yeah. <laughs> Look at the beautiful red ones here. Wow. That's real. This are, these are real, yeah. They're just dried out. Oh my gosh. Wow, that's, that's a village in France and that actually exists. Yeah? Yeah. I'm not sure. He painted this. Oh, there's Morin. So he was an artist. Wow, it's actually pretty well done, I would say. Yeah, yeah. Very unique style. And he probably painted this one as well. There's no signature yeah, there's on there. No signature. He looks the same, yeah. He definitely loved art. Yeah, oh, yeah, sure. yeah. No <laughs> doubt about that. Oh, wow. This is a, a vase painted with a scenery of Africa. A vase? I think this, that's an African, I know, yeah. Just a vase, yeah, okay. I, I thought it was something African, wow. but it's not. Oh, There's the nature. Wow. Beautiful. Let's see what's behind this one. Oh, look at this, Danny. We're not gonna go in here, but here you can see the top. Of I'm gonna start showing the ceiling and then. Yeah. Oh. Don't go in there, that's, no, no, no. it's falling. It's gonna show falling it apart. Really, really bad. Really bad. So sad for this building. It's a beautiful building. Yeah. It's a beautiful chateau. Oh my gosh, the face fell on the ground. This is Chinese face. Probably worth so much money. And then boom on the ground and it broke. Wow. Oh. Again. <laughs> yeah. We have I, to show all of those. Yeah, I cannot stop showing this. They are so beautiful. I've seen a lot of these, mm -hmm. especially in France, the, the places that we explored. But these are s different. They're so beautiful. Yeah, it's true. Wow. Okay. You want to show a bedroom first or you want to show that very unique room first? Yeah. Let's, let's save it for a little yeah. bit. Let's show yeah, the we're going to let you guys wait a little bit. <laughs> Here you can already see. The wallpaper is peeling off the walls. This place is falling apart. And here we come into one of the first bedrooms. And it still has a warm, cozy feeling when you come inside of here. Yeah, downstairs it's cold. cold. Yeah, and here it's warm. So it's quite strange. At first I thought that the heating was on in this building, but it's not. The beds are still made. Typical French beds, slate beds they would be called. As you can see, yeah. thick wood. Thick, thick wood. Wow. It's incredible. And you can also see that it's French because they have like these hidden doorways over here. Yeah. This is just a I cabinet. I love that about France. Yeah. They are like everywhere in every single place you see them. <laughs> this is a style element from back in that time and it's just so beautiful. For example, in the camera, you probably don't see it, but there's a hidden door. Oh yeah. Here. Yeah. There's two actually. That's probably a closet. Yeah, I'm not gonna open it because yeah. it will knock down everything, but But it's it's so cool because yeah. in the camera you barely see it. It's absolutely crazy. Danny, you gotta tell me, doesn't this look like somebody came out of his bed and never made his bed again? I mean yeah. Yeah. Kind of. Like they came one last time out of bed and left it like this. It's just crazy. And I think that might have happened even. This looks, like this, this looks lift in. Oh. Sorry, I love this. The duck? Duck, duck lamp. <laughs> yeah, it's it's a, lamp. a lamp inside. Yeah, yeah. a lamp underneath there. Yeah. And here you can see the door. The seams right. of the door. <laughs> oh. There's a lot of clothing that has not been neatly folded inside of here. <laughs> Just thrown inside Drawing of the inside. cabinet. <laughs> wow. And a little extra one over here as well. Does this look like man's or woman's clothing? What do we have here? Flag of the United States, hot station sportswear. This looks like man's clothing to my opinion. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. You can go in front of me, Danny. Oh. Another bedroom. Yeah, every single room in this house most likely has still been used. As you can see, everything is like yeah, a little bit overdrawn, but still. Yeah. Used. That is a 
medical bed over yeah, here. Yeah, that's the. We have to point out the elephant yeah, of in the room. Course. And it might look like a children's medical bed because it's quite small, right? I'm not sure. Maybe for the mother. I have no idea. Maybe for Marin when he got older. Oh, I have no idea. But I love that the wallpaper is just falling off. You see the wallpaper peeling off, and behind it is the old wallpaper. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. I didn't even notice. Oh, and up there you can even see the third wallpaper. Yeah. You see? <laughs> they never take it down. They just plaster yeah. wallpaper over wallpaper over oh wallpaper. Oh, God. <laughs> and I love when the wallpaper literally falls over the bed. Yeah. It's so special. Wow. Beautifully carved bed again. Wonderful piece. Oh, I have to show you the top of it. Oh, the top of it, it's beautiful. It's so different, never seen something like it. Oh. And again, in this room as well, a built-in cabinet with clothing still left in there. And screwing. Yeah, exactly. Oh, the wallpaper literally <laughs> hanging on it. <laughs> Another one of their children, and from a different angle. And this is the vanity over here, as you can see, <laughs> with also the wallpaper falling over it. Yeah. The same unique design over there. Oh. Wow, let's see if there's something still in here. <laughs> Socks and everything. Yeah. Still <laughs> neatly folded. Just the way that you fold it. Yeah. It's the same exact way. <laughs> wow. Crazy. Oh, this looks like something hand drawn, Danny. Look at that. Yeah. Bonne fête, maman. Wow. Looks like from one of the children, maybe even. See? Probably. And then the closet over here. Wardrobe. Wardrobe. <laughs> the very large mirror at the front. I love that I'm here to correct you. <laughs> <laughs> the blankets and everything are still in there. Oh, wow. Again. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah. Danny? You know what that room over there is? Uh, the corner of the castle. Yeah, but also the tower. Oh, the tower. What, yeah. what did I say? The corner of the castle, you said. Sorry, I'm It is also the corner of the castle. I'm dyslexic. <laughs> Sometimes I don't say what I want to say. It's also wow. the bathroom of this place. I love that it's painted with frescoes. Oh, look at that. Beautiful ceiling. Wow. It doesn't Good. smell nice, but no, no, it's, not at all. <laughs> it's beautiful, and I, I, I have a weird thing to say. Like, to come into this bedroom, yeah. you have to cross the other bedroom. Yeah. And from that bedroom to go to the bathroom, you have to cross this bedroom. Yeah. So they never had privacy. You see this a lot in France, where the rooms are like connected like that. So no, they didn't have privacy at all back in the time. Uh, mm. No. We see, we see that a lot in. in in Portugal and Spain, yeah. that we have corridors connecting yeah. everything. In here, there's not a lot no. of corridors, it's just a stairway. A stairway, but it's actually all over the north of Europe like that. Yeah. And the south of Europe has corridors. So, design aspects, different. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just pointing it out because it's Before we leave this room, different. look at this enormous spider webs that we have over here. And there's again a big spider in there. Yeah. Oh yeah, don't, don't, don't leave the spider, please. <laughs> Beautiful. Are you all ready for that room that we were just talking about? I know I am. <laughs> oh, I am too. This was Maureen, his special room in the place. Look at this beauty. I've never seen something like this before. This is a complete room, everybody, dedicated to his passion for Africa. Everything in here relates to that. I don't even know where to start. But yeah, <laughs> let's just start somewhere, but <laughs> with the enormous library he had you can see over here, Algeria and different places. Also plants and everything are depicted in here. 
he had an enormous library talking about history, work, history yeah. and everything. Oh my god, wait, let me show. This looks very old, this book. Oh my god. Be careful touching it. Can I open it? Yeah. Oh, even the writing in it is so special. Oh, I have to put it back because I feel it falling apart. Danny, I'm gonna show you something now. Inside of this library here is a, if I'm not mistaken, a puffer fish. One of those fishes that blow up. A balloon, yeah. Balloon, the balloon fish. fish. <laughs> I don't know the actual And it's a real one, for sure. Yeah. It's just been dried, as you can see. Oh my god. <laughs> so crazy. Standing here in the library. They are poisonous, if I'm not mistaken. I have no idea. Wow. I was just looking and there's a court saying... Uh, Carte de nature, bonsoir. Yes, for Maureen. UNICEF. Oh, so he's a donator for UNICEF. Donateur means like he gives money to them. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 I mean, he's rich, so... Yeah, but it's also very nice of him to do so. Yeah, of course. Absolutely. Of course. Because you can be rich and not do it, eh? True. This wonderful photo over here. That's a beautiful photo. That's a wedding picture, actually. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, old wedding picture, yeah, yeah, you're right. Oh. Don't know from who, but it looks very old. Yeah. <laughs> a bag made of snake skin. Oh. Yeah. Meh. A holster for shotgun rounds. <laughs> Can you see this one here? Yeah. It's a... African music instrument. Yeah, it's a music instrument, yeah. Oh. Two oh, pictures yeah. as well. Depicting French towns, of course. Yep. A shell. A beautiful shell. Wow, it looks so fragile. Yeah. And this, I have no clue what it is. No idea. It's also leather skin on it and stuff like that, but. I have no idea what that is. Oh, this might be nah. around your neck and then for arrows, for shooting. Uh, probably. Yeah. It's a bit small. A bit small. Is it open in the Yeah, the open end? at the front and close at the bottom. Oh, ah, okay. Yeah, Maybe, so you yeah. might wear it around the neck with arrows inside of it. Next table? Next table? Yeah. Let's go table by table. Table by table. Here we can see stuff that I have no clue about what it is. I think that's a, a coconut, coconut shell. Coconut shell, yeah, yeah, I think. And then completely carved. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Took a lot of work to make. <laughs> yeah. And it's definitely handmade. Another handmade face or something here. Oh. Looks all so fragile. Oh. Let's yeah, like, don't there's... destroy this stuff. Wow. Another vase. Small version. You can see a picture of a town, I think, from the top of a cathedral or a church. This is sent by the Minister of Defense from France, 1975 to Morin, and it responds to something that I cannot read. Letter de felicitations. Yeah, yeah, congratulations. congratulations. Yeah, exactly. So he probably did something noble. Some that pictures. Looks very Portuguese. Oh yeah. Weird. Some pictures that he took. Postcards that he sent. All African postcards, as you can see. Wow. <laughs> and here are all the stamps, all the unused stamps left behind. Three French francs, it says over there. French francs have not been used for decades now. Wow. Okay, what else do we got here? Small purse. Nothing in there anymore. It's already a super interesting so table. So unique things. Like this, if they were not stuck together, this was worth a lot. Absolutely. For collectors. Like Absolutely. I, it's, yeah. So much beautiful <sighs> stuff. Oh. Let's go further here. Yeah. yeah. I can see a sort of pencil drawing, I think. Is it made this. by Maureen? No. It doesn't look like it. doesn't look like it. And also weapons and everything oh, hanging here on the wall. It looks like a extra. African masks. It's so beautiful. 
piece of stone he found. And this might have been his forefathers or his father and his mother, as you can see. Looks the same as the other photo that was yeah. on the table. Oh, so they might have gotten married and that and their child is Maureen then. Yeah. That yeah, might probably. be the case here. Yeah. Chisels or something. All still neatly hanging here. He was so proud of his work in Africa. He bought brought so much stuff back. Danny, this is incredibly heavy. I cannot even yeah. lift this with one hand. Looks like a hammer of some sort. Jeez. Oh. Enormous shell. Yeah, it looks so fragile. Yeah. Oh, here they are again. Yeah, definitely. This definitely young boy familiar. might have been Maureen. <laughs> I'm not sure though, I'm just seeing something. Uh, but... Oh yeah, I don't know. Wow. So much beautiful art in this place. I thought it was a gun at first, but it's not. Yeah. I don't even know what it is. <laughs> and there we see an antler of an African animal. I'm not sure which one. Looks beautiful. Oh, it's beautiful. And this I also, yeah. This is the coat hanger. Point out. A coat hanger? Or oh, it's just, just for the door? I'm, it might be a coat hanger. I have no idea, but it's so beautiful. Do really look beautiful. at this room? Yeah. Careful. Oh, it's like a sort of archive room. No way, Danny. What? <laughs> you smell it, right? Yeah. Oh, oh my God, the smell is so intense. Oh. <gasps> again? Yeah, again. Again. <laughs> we found another beehive in an abandoned oh place. God, the I smell is so something. intense. And this one is so big that it literally pushes out the window. The window cannot close anymore. Oh, crazy. <laughs> Uh, thousands upon thousands of bees making honey there. Oh, there's a wonderful African mask over here. Can you show? Yeah, sure. No, no, no. Just show it to the camera. Yeah, I'll turn around. Wow, even if the straw and everything's still hanging underneath there. Can you? Yeah. Yeah, I will show something. Let me take out the cable, can some connect it to there? Yeah. Oh my, Danny. We'll have to be, yeah, careful, be careful with the bees, with the bees because they're but... starting to get angry. Look at the map behind here. That's such a beautiful map hanging here. Wow. And all the artifacts on top of this desk here. Hundreds of pictures. And if you look at your right, the bags of them are on the floor. I was looking at this device here. Which bags? The bags, the, the African bags. Oh on the floor. yeah. Maybe he traveled with those bags to Africa. Yeah. He probably traveled to those bags to Africa. I'm gonna give you the camera again. Oh yeah, show there's bees, there's bees. Yeah, let's, I know I wanna show let's, one let's more Hold it, oh, hold oh, the camera. Oh. I don't have gloves, if they yeah. bite me. Oh, oh. Come, okay. come here, come yeah. here. Beat time again. <laughs> I wanted to show one more thing in the room. Yeah, I saw it up there. <sighs> okay. Okay, really quickly. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, let's show it real quick. These are dangerous, everybody. <laughs> yeah, and I don't have gloves if they sting me. The saddle. You know what this is? Yeah, for the snow. This is a slat for the snow. <laughs> I love it. Okay, okay. let's go let's out of here. Let's close this door. Yeah. Let's close this archive. <sighs> oh. Oh, one flew out. Oh, Jesus. You good? Yeah, I think I'm good. I think I... <sighs> okay, bees are fun to see in locations, but are pretty dangerous. Yeah. <laughs> Let's focus on his desk, I would say. Yeah. This was uh, Morin's desk, where he spent a lot of time researching and stuff like that. Wow. What do we have over here? That's a musical instrument. Oh, no. Oh, it's looks, looks, very... looks very you... fragile as well. Yeah, but it's like this. You just pull it down. Wow. Beautiful instrument. Books left here that he read. Oh, they look very complicated. That's that's a, a plant of a city. Oh, really? He even had a model airplane of Air Africa here, Danny. <laughs> wow. Yeah. It's beautiful. I love it. And then the lamp even depicts Africa, as you can see. Or does it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Afri uh, Af Africo. Africo. 
Revolution of France. <laughs> of course, this is also a Frenchman. It's not only because he loves Africa. And we got a beautiful photo of something here. A waterfall. Yeah, oh yeah, a waterfall. Very faded. Yeah. And then over here is a passport of Maurin. His name and everything is underneath there, so I'm not going to show it, but yeah. And I think there's more here. <sighs> Let's not show. That's everything of his is still left here. Is there something in this library that's interesting? Mm. This is all history of France. Okay. Resistance. Yep, all the history of France. France. <laughs> <laughs> and then here he got a beautiful display of all these different artifacts that he collected. I don't know what these are, I'm not gonna try to even describe them. No, I'm gonna try to describe I think this is an axe. Yeah, that's that's, that's, that's pretty axe. obvious. Oh, this is also beautiful. Look at that. All it's handmade. Wood? Yeah, it's wood. Wow. Yeah. Are those earrings? No, I think they were to hold something. Mm. Wow, wonderful mask. I love all of this. Excuse me? Okay, bees. <laughs> bees start to fly. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Look at this instrument we're standing next to here. It's broken, unfortunately, at the top. Yeah. This used to be some sort of a drum. Yeah. <laughs> and up there is another animal head. Just the antlers. Just the antlers, yeah. Wow. If you come to this side, yeah, I'll go around. There's like the biggest shells that I've ever seen any up there. Oh yeah. Oh, these are. Can you imagine a snail or a sea animal that's that large? <laughs> yeah. They're literally the size of my head. Yeah, they're <laughs> really big. Look at this book here in the library. It's literally falling apart. You taped it up and everything. Anything else interesting that you see over there? No, I'm just slowly backing up. Because I don't want to hit anything. There's so many things in this room. Yeah. Oh, what's that? Beautiful chair. This is very heavy. Oh, it's a mirror. Really? Yeah. Yeah. So oh, no, no, no. Turn around. There was something there. It disappeared. Oh. It's like that's the back of something. Oh, it's really heavy, though. Yeah. Really heavy. And now the elephant in the room, the spears, you probably already saw them. He has like a bunch of spears standing here and hanging on the wall. <laughs> Have you ever seen something like this in an abandoned no. place? So crazy and the carvings in there. Yeah. Every single one is very unique. I think you would call them javelin in English. Ja javelin. I have no idea. And then this instrument, me and Danny were already discussing what it might have been. There's wheels underneath it. If, if you roll it on the ground, everything would, is going to rotate, I think. No, no, it's going to make a lot of noise. I think it was a pipe. But you think it was a pipe? Yeah, a very big pipe. I don't think it was a pipe. If anybody know. knows what this instrument here is, Please let us know. It's so cool, though. I think I think it was it's one of those that you roll on the ground and everything moves. Oh, beautiful. But I'm not sure. It's really beautiful, and the colors yeah. of it are amazing. Talking about colors, I haven't shown the wallpaper. Oh, really? Yeah. Because it's not wall. Is it, is it wallpaper or is it, is it? I think it's even more than wallpaper. Like it's yeah. sort of a 3D. It's, it's yeah, incredible. It's incredible. It also gives life to the room. Yeah. Danny, this is Lily Morin, his life's work that we are looking at. This man spent his lifetime collecting these artifacts and then at a certain point he passed away and now it's all left here. Everything left behind. That's just how it goes in life. Live your life, Morin definitely had a good life though. Yeah, a good life, yeah. we can see that. But after really your death, sad. everything is gone everybody, everything is gone. So not everything is gone, everything is just left here. Yeah, you, yeah. you just leave everything You don't behind. take anything. You don't, you don't. <laughs> Are you showing this one? No. Oh, it's also sort of a wonderful instrument. 
Get some rain there. Yeah, it looks like a rabbit. So you have to make noise then. Also show the painting up there. Very beautiful with the colors, the sunset and everything. Wow. Okay. The next floor, everybody. But before we go even further up, look at this. Yeah. <laughs> look at this. I was so surprised when I first saw it inside of this place. But this is a bellow, everybody, to a scale of I don't know what. <laughs> yeah, I also don't know what it's enormous. I think it's for a big furnace or something to to pump air into it. Do you think they worked with it? I don't think it's like a I think decoration. It's a decoration piece. I don't think so. I think they actually worked with this. Yeah. Yeah. Back in the time, it looks so, so well oh, made. Probably one of those. Uh, to work with the uh, iron or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah, the blast probably, furnace. Yeah, no, old blast furnace. He probably bought it or something. Yeah. yeah. And I put some flans over, and that's like a beautiful decorational piece in the hallway. Yeah. I've explored so many abandoned buildings, but never seen something like that yeah. before. This is a beautiful decoration piece. Yeah. Not a chair. I love it. <laughs> a chair in the stairs. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <I'm> still. <laughs> you know this? Uh, this. Of course, Notre Dame. Notre Dame de Paris. Fortunately, burned down. But they're restoring it. And then a wonderful plate here as well. Oh, and another one with the butterfly wings. I find that so unique. Yeah, it is. It's so cool. Sorry, what is this? Oh, can we even open it? I already tried multiple times, but it seems ah, to be it's locked. locked. Okay. Yeah, it seems to be locked and I cannot get in here. I cannot look underneath here. There's nothing. No, okay. it's just a storage area. Okay. <laughs> Look, even more. The butterfly wings. Wow. And then again, a broadery, a tapestry hanging here on the wall. <sighs> this one has so many wonderful, vibrant colors. Yeah. Can you check the painting behind there? as well. Oh. I just wanted to see if it has had a mark of Maureen on it. Because it again looks like something African, fisherman or something. But yeah. I don't see any signature I on it. I don't think so. No, I don't think so. No. Wow. And we here we come to another floor of the castle. Yeah. You can choose. This one. This one? This side? Right. Yeah. Okay. Let's have a look. Ooh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's a bit overthrown here, everything. Yeah. As you can see, a lot of clothes have been pulled out of the cabinets, wardrobes. And not just this, but also the DK behind you. Oh, oh, I didn't even see that. Oh my yeah. God. The mold and the water Ugh. that is going inside. Is... Ugh. Yeah. Okay, let's not stay there for too long. Let's see this room here. Oh, love the heaven bed here. Wow. So beautiful. Definitely Actually one of the main beautiful. beds. Yeah. See over here. Bonne fête, maman. Ma maman préférée, je t'aime beaucoup. And this is like a little love letter written by the child to Patrick to his mother. It's beautiful. So the mother of the family used to sleep here, maybe together with Maureen. You can see that the whole bed is overthrown. Stuff everywhere. Oh, Danny, at the end of the bed, there are even pictures there. No way. The mother holding her child, and the young man next to it. Wow. Wow. The candle and everything is left behind here. What oh, must have happened wow, to this place? This is beautiful. Oh, I didn't even see that one yet. Oh, can you even focus on it? Very unique, eh? Yeah, it is. Is there some clothes left in here? These all look like ladies' clothes, yeah. Oh yeah, the whole water over here is filled with ladies' clothes. Okay. Here we got another photo of a lady, of a woman. This might have been his wife when she was a little bit older. Yeah. Looks like it. Yeah. Yeah. Seems very reasonable to me. <laughs> the 
television and everything still yeah. left here. Definitely one of the last rooms that they used this place. And here, what do we have over here? It looks like a closet. Yeah. Some sort of. You can see that there's wallpaper for the children. Yeah. Definitely the one that had the motorcycle downstairs. <laughs> <laughs> oh. A lot of bags and everything left here. Even a picture. Oh no, a postcard, as you can see. Written by Patrick. Oh. So the, that's from the letter that we just saw. <laughs> you want 10 liters of uh, holy water, Danny? Yeah. <laughs> Lotus. Jeez. You can literally buy like a whole thing Gallon. of holy water. Yeah. A hearing aid also left here. So somebody had hearing problems in this place. And again, oh. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to cover the names. Oh, yeah. th this is um, from Morin again. Yeah, this is the ID, you see? Yeah, Carte uh, na Nationality Identity. And yeah. Try to cover. <laughs> yeah. So we think that this might have been uh, the mother of his, of his wife. Wow. Issued in 1993. So maybe that's the date when I came to France. Uh, yeah, probably. Not long ago. Not long ago, no. So 10 years before it got abandoned. Wow. I already saw something in that hallway. Look up the door. The, the the drawing up there? Yeah. Yeah. It looks creepy, but it's so beautiful. It's very unique. Oh. Morin. Signature? Yep. Oh, he even made this one. Yep. It's it's a, a fox or something getting trapped in it. Yeah. <sighs> Wanna have a look in that room as well, Danny? Yep. Oh, there's so much stuff. Oh. Whoa. Thrown away. Oh, this is definitely lifted. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, the whole bed is filled with glass and stuff. But this is. Wow. Is this like a. Oh, Morin, it says over here. 1947. But this looks like before his time. Maybe his father was also called Morin. Probably. 1990. No, 1916. 1916. That's very old, yeah. And then the wonderful bed over here in the corner of the room. Typical French bed, unlike yeah. the heaven bed that we just saw. Beautiful. Yeah. Everything's still present. The vanity's also full of stuff. Yeah, Jeez. so much stuff. There's a lot of uh, Chinese or Japanese stuff, you know? That's true. So, yeah. maybe the son, his son, Patrick, mm -hmm. loved, lo loved it. That's why he sent postcards from oh, there. Yeah. yeah, maybe he went a lot on vacation yeah. to there. Uh, yeah, wardrobe here. Again, filled with <laughs> clothing. And I saw also some African art on top of the fireplace here. Wow. Monsieur, another section over here. Merci, monsieur. There he is. Not a problem. I got another lovely bedroom here. Wow. <laughs> this bed is huge. Yeah, what I always find so fascinating is how high it used to be back in the time to get yeah. into your bed. Yeah. I'm pretty tall, but for those people, it must have been a, ha a hell of a big job yeah, to get inside. A job to go. Jeez, multiple mattresses stacked on top of each other. <laughs> Multiple layers as well. I love it though. It's quite special. What do we have over here? Which one? Is, oh, oh my God! Look at. The, do you think it's wallpaper or paint? That I just, think it's paint from the ceiling. You think this is a whole complete paint that just came off? 
No, that's wallpaper. Oh, that's wallpaper. So, so they wallpapered their ceilings. The ceilings. <laughs> they wallpapered that's, their that's ceilings. New. Yeah, over there you can see there's still a piece hanging that's uh, yeah. about to fall. So yeah. yeah, that fell down and covered the wardrobe over here. Yeah, it looks so crazy. <laughs> yeah, and all the bed linen and everything is still inside of there. Wow. Oh my God, Danny. <sighs> yep. Ooh. Oh. The floor makes a lot of noise. We got a very pristine animal, taxidermy animal, lying here on the bed. Look how beautiful it looks. I don't know what kind of, is a ferret or something? No, that's, I have a fox. fox. Yeah. Fox. Looking at its tail, it might have been, yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. yeah. Tail of a fox. Oh. Look how pristine this bed still is. Yeah. Oh wow, so beautiful, mm -hmm. looks so sad. Not a face, oh, this doesn't look like a real one. Yeah, <laughs> face 95 <of> francs. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually nothing. That's like maybe one yeah, or two euros. Nowadays, yeah. Just give them a look at the wallpaper up there. Yeah. How it's slowly separating from the ceiling. Glue doesn't last forever, everybody. <laughs> yep. Oh, French town, Le Lue. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah, French towns are so incredible. Can you see it also though? How? The secret, I... secret doors. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Be careful in there. There's some secret doors behind here. Oh, oh, look at that. Even the clothing is still in here. Yeah. Yeah, there's like a big mirror standing against the secret door. <laughs> And there's one uh, under it, but yeah. probably the same. Yeah. I wanted to show this cabinet as well. And this is definitely a cabinet inside a bedroom, which is quite, quite yeah. weird. Weird. Yeah. Ooh. That's really weird. Yeah, yeah, I already saw it. It's, it's crazy. Why? It's filled with cups and plates and everything. <laughs> Why? Very beautiful ones. Can you take one of them? Yeah, it's a very nice tea set, I think. Tea or coffee. Look oh, at wow, look at the... Can I... Yeah, sure. Look at the <sighs> paintings in it. So beautiful. Place it neatly back. Like we found it. All, even everything is like still angled also correctly. And yeah. Wow, it's so beautiful. <laughs> yeah, my OCD is like good, <laughs> good today. <laughs> okay, let me close this one up. This deserves to be closed up. Yeah. I can mix it with the keys that are over here so nobody goes and fiddles with that. Before you go into this room, oh, let me just yeah. show this one. Dead nature. I mean, kind of dead nature. It's dead nature. <laughs> yeah, definitely dead, but I don't yeah. know if it's called dead nature with animals. Okay, wonderful cabinet. There's a room behind here as well. Another bedroom, a couple of beds in here. Yeah, definitely, I think more than six people lived in here. So we had Moran, his wife, their four children, probably their mother as well. Maybe even other people lived in here. So yeah. the house would be filled with people. Love that the beds are still made here. Looping, made in Paris, Parisian back. A doll from a child still left here. Wow. Oh, yeah, also hidden doorways. Yeah. Be careful, that one is like slightly tilted, slightly, slightly tilted. Wow. Crazy. This is, this is also. Somebody was packing a suitcase. Crazy. Look at that. A suitcase, and there's like clothes in there, but they're never finished. That's what I'm saying. It looks so crazy. Yeah, this is Morana's suitcase. Yeah? Yeah, with his address and everything on there. No way. He was packing up a suitcase. See over there? Can I just show this one? Oh, yeah, sure. It's, it's a religious open. depiction. And then we got a tower over here. This is the last part of the tower, I think. Yeah. Here you see that Chinese art coming back again. Look above you, Danny. Yeah. Oh. 
or oh, Japanese yeah. art. I'm not sure. Japanese, yeah, yeah. Looks very Japanese to me. It's like one of those umbrellas, Japanese umbrellas oh, made of paper. The frescoes on the ceiling yeah, and everything. So beautiful, and the walls also. I was oh. just looking at it. It's so what a room, man. But this was kind of a bathroom, and yeah, there's a fridge, a Christmas tree. <laughs> there's a wardrobe. There's a cupboard over here. There's a fridge upstairs. There's even a dining table here in the middle. Yeah, so what? it's a bit weird. Yeah. Did I live up here? Probably. It's maybe it's separate or something. Yeah. It's so crazy. Okay. Attic. Attic. Let's go. Very unique locking style mechanism. Love it. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, those sounds are not nice. They reveal an ancient attic. Welcome, everybody. <laughs> oh, there's bird shit everywhere. <laughs> yeah, it's not clean. No, nobody has been here for forever, oh. I think. And I feel wind, so yeah. probably everything is open. Yeah, it's just uh, there's no window anymore here. It's literally raining inside right now. Oh. See over here on the floor. That's why the building is decaying. Yeah. Sort of a oh, play wow. area for the children. Even a castle up there. Yeah. Can I show that up close? Oh, yeah, sure. Wow. That's a wonderful castle. Yeah. Looks also handmade. Wow. Because they're lifting the castle and then they still play with the castle. Yeah. Oh. oh. Yeah. That's why the room below here. It's like decaying. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The, the one that has the mold. Yeah, yeah. That's because it drips water. There's hmm. no, there's no roof tiles anymore. Nothing. Sad. So so sad. Okay, let's see like that if, side. If if they had someone to take care of this, at least to take care to not fall. Yeah, they don't even have to like. They just have to make sure the roof is good and stuff like that, and that will be enough. Yeah, there's also true. a soccer they table could, here. They could take care of it. Want to play a match, Danny? <laughs> I'm just falling apart. <laughs> yeah. Nothing much up here. I love that bed. Can I show it? Yeah, sure. Wow. Oh, wow. Yeah, I didn't even see oh, that one yet. There's a bird there. There's a pigeon. Okay, let's not... You see it on the corner? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah I see him. Yeah, yeah, over there. Just let him be because he already smells. Yeah, pigeon. Big okay. table. Let's go. Yeah, we're now going to go to the outside. Yeah, yeah. we want to show you the outside. We want to show you the outside. So beautiful. Okay, let's go over there. Whenever we leave these places, we also make sure that we sort of lock them up again. How we found them. Like like how we found them. Yeah. So close the shutters. These doors are gonna be closed behind me. Yep. And okay. Voila. That's it. That's what we do. Yep. That's how it was. Okay. Okay. Good. We are now here outside in the overthrown courtyard of the place. You can see nobody has been here for a very long time. Oof, Danny. Let's go over here. Oh my God. Yeah. Like there's trees growing everywhere. Everywhere. I think this used to all be clean when they still lived here. Yeah, most likely. Nothing was here. You want to check out this place? Yeah, I saw there's a tower. Yeah. Or no. This one also has a tower. Yeah? Yeah. This place has a tower and this place has a tower. Oh, okay. Let me see. I think this is the main entrance, or used to be the main entrance to the place. You can see nobody has come in here for a long time. Ooh. Yeah, be careful. There's a lot of water falling. Yep. 
E you're making it rain. Making it rain. Wow. Can I even look back? I can see the outside of the place. No, you cannot see. No. Look into the camera. Oh, there's trees everywhere. <laughs> there's trees everywhere. <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna show you this. This probably was the barn of the castle. All the toys of the children still here. Do you think this was like the servants' quarters or something? I think in the ancient times, yes. Yeah. They didn't live together with, uh, with the yeah, people. Yeah, because this is completely separate. Yeah. But later on, they used it for different purposes. See, this is the, uh, the oval shape of the other tower. Yeah. That's what we have over here. Of course, religious depictions. Yeah. What did you expect? Oh, there's a wonderful oil lamp. Wow. That is incredible. If you replace the glass, you have still a very nice oil lamp. Yeah, looks pristine. Yeah. Okay. What a piece. Oh. Oh, please don't go in. No, it's very can dangerous. You, can you come out because I cannot film with oh, you? Oh, yeah, there. of course. I'm going to show you guys why I'm saying don't go in. The whole floor has fallen. Jeez. Somebody has to come and save this place fast. Yeah. Like, literally, there's a hole in the roof. <laughs> and this is the tower. Look how the tower is constructed. With this oh, wow. Rocks. Wonderful stones. Like, the outside, I think, has uh, cement, but this is the original. Yeah. Just rock. Crazy. Very lengthy process, I think. Yeah. I just even saw that there was a sort of basement in this place, or a wine cellar. <laughs> Look over there in the wall. It's like a bunch of bottles left over there. Yeah. They're all empty, I think. Yeah, I think that's the corner of empty bottles. Yeah. A lot of oh, walnuts wow. on the floor as well here. Hmm. Look at that. And have you seen? It has the arch shape. Oh, yeah. Wow, the same as we saw in the kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> the Christmas tree is left here. This was their storage area. And some jars with food. And even hundreds of more bottles of wine. I thought there. Oh, Danny, in here? Yeah. I see an oval wine cellar. And here are still some closed bottles. Oh, oh wow. this is the tower. This yeah, is this is the tower. tower, yeah. Yeah. Look. These are wine bottles. Wow. Probably yeah. very old. You smell it, right? Yeah, I smell wine. Yeah. Oh, wow, they are still closed and everything. Yeah, 2005 is this one. This one is 20, 18 years old. Ooh. These ones down here are completely molded up. <laughs> crazy Whoa. stuff. This is so crazy to see. Here you can get a view of the castle and the structure of it. It's actually such a tall building. Yeah. Wow. And it's so overgrown, so overgrown. <laughs> I'm so excited for this one. It's such yeah. a cool video. I want to thank you all. What a story from Marin who went to Africa, found his wife to have brought him here and then everything inside the castle as well. I hope you enjoyed another oh, castle, yeah. Danny. Of course, this was <laughs> magnificent, yeah. crazy story. Definitely check out the man behind the camera, thank Mr. You. Danny, his link is in the so description. Much. Also like the video, subscribe to the channel, write a nice comment. And there's also links in the description to support us and donate a little bit to us. With that all said, thank you so much for watching. I will see you next week in another amazing episode. Bye-bye. I love you. Bye.